Yesterday we spoke about Hydrogen OS 5.1.11 which brings a ton of improvements and if you've still not checked that video out, here's a card to that video. That is basically the same software that is now being rolled out to the international OnePlus 6 devices as Oxygen OS 5.1.9. Now, I thought that, you know, a lot of people have not received it. So why not share a video wherein every time you get an OTA update, what is the quickest and fastest way to get it? And apart from that, I will also leave the download links in the description for this particular update. The complete ROM can now be downloaded, but there is an app called Oxygen Updater. I'm sure a lot of you would be aware of that so you can use that app to just go ahead and download the latest and greatest from oneplus so this is going to be a very very short and quick video showing you how to update to oxygen os 5.1.9 and later maybe there is a video coming of camera comparison between 5.1.8 and 5.1.9 i'm not really sure what the results would be but i will try to make a video on that and comment down and let me know if you want me to make a video comparing the camera between these two updates reason for that is oneplus is claiming that they have improved the image quality and they will continue to do that at the same time the video for hydrogen os to oxygen os or oxygen os to hydrogen os is in the works that should be coming out any moment now maybe today or tomorrow i don't really know that but i'm working as soon as i can for now, if you haven't already, please subscribe because, hey, we do awesome stuff with smartphones at Smartphone Tutorials. At the same time, hit that notification bell icon so that you don't miss an important update from us. And if you like motorbikes and travel is your thing, well, here's a card to my second channel that is Kratos390. Go ahead and check that channel out as well. Now, without further ado, hello, awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's get flashing. How could I know you falling to grabbing the wind? All right, guys, welcome to the channel. So this is going to be a very, very short video because there's nothing much that needs to be done. And I will not be covering how to install it via TWRP because basically you can install any ROM using TWRP and then flash the TWRP installer and Majesk and you should be good to go. But if a lot of you are interested, yes, again, comment in the description and comment below the video. I will try to make a video on that. But for now, as we can see, I've just set it up so this device that you're looking at right now is running oxygen os 5.1.8 and if we go to system updates there are no updates available so as always has been the case with oneplus devices that the update rolls out in phases and if you want to get it sooner there are two ways to do it one the link is mentioned in the description go ahead and download that file that is a complete 5.1.9 update and you can download that file and copy it to your phone's internal memory that is one way of doing it so after you've copied it to your phone's internal memory you just need to go to settings and then system updates and then click this gear icon over here and select local upgrade and you will see that this file is here but the moment you tap on it it will ask you install now so you can click on install now and it will update and then maybe if you wish you can go ahead and do a factory reset that is one way of doing it the second option here is oxygen updater now this app i'll leave the link in the description it is available on play store for free so if you were to go to oxygen updater all right so let's set this app first so choose your device here it does say that this is a one plus six so that's good and it's not mandatory to have root access so that's okay and choose update method it is asking us so i will select an incremental update because that reduces the size of your download so if you are someone who's on a metered connection or doesn't have really really fast internet you can choose this method here and after that you can start the app and as soon as you start the app you will notice that it does say that the update is available and if you want to know you know what changes are there well i've mentioned a card at the start of the video you can go ahead and check that video so now scroll down and it says it's a 342 megabytes update versus the update which we manually downloaded was around 1.4 or 1.5 gigabytes so let's go ahead and download it and let's see if it actually works all right so now as you can see the download is complete it has a few set of instructions right all the steps down this that etc etc so first what you have to do is close oxygen updater by pressing the home button open settings app it should be located in your app drawer scroll down to you, till you see system updates and tap on it so let's go ahead and do that so let's go to settings system updates 
All right, so looks like now we have a similar process. So we go here, local upgrade. And as you can see, now we have a 358 MB OT update. So we can select this, install now. So the end process for both the updates is the same. It is just that you get a smaller sized file using Oxygen Updater. You can choose incremental updates. And if you wish, you can go ahead and download the complete update as well. And after this, the process is pretty, pretty simple. The update will be installed and you just have to reboot and you should be good to go. Thanks to Project Treble. So this was a very, very quick and short video, guys, how to install Oxygen OS 5.1.9. I'm working on a few more videos for the OnePlus 6 and stay tuned. And if you like this video, make sure you give this video a like and comment anything that you would like to and do share your feedback in the comment section if there's anything else that you would like to see on this particular channel. For now, this is Kailash signing off with Smartphone Tutorials. Until next time, keep smiling, take care, goodbye.